everyone welcome to series 16 summer festival playlist as you can see we had an update and i'll go over the weekly forzaton challenge and also the cars that i use for the championships now let's have a look at the forzaton shop as you can see there's a 2014 ferrari in it and it says one per customer also a horn and then five per customer super wheel spins and one per customer legendary austin martin vulcan well when i saw that i almost felt off my share laughing i have no idea why this is but i think it's pretty funny if you see this well let's go back to the forzaton so as you can see we need to own and drive a truck we need to earn 10 trading pain skills 10 wreckage skills and we need a win uh, road racing series on the goliath now as you can see i have the 2015 mercedes benz for that the truck so the 10 trading skills you just do it on the highway don't drive too fast because it's a big truck you can barely see anything just hit the side of the traffic cars and you will make it 10 racket skills just go to the the walls that you can break or the fences and you will also get that and then you have a road racing series on the goliath i made a blueprint uh, just like last week but this is just driving straight and then you will have the forzaton so it's a pretty easy forzaton now let's have a look at i'll go to the map quickly that's easier to show everything so let's go let's get over to the trial we need a800 classic racers and it's road racing now the car that i use for that i was actually gonna use the porsche from last time but i put it also in my subscription uh, description this is a car that i used um for the trial the shelby cobra daytona very good car it was very easy to win um, but you can also use this car because i don't know if everybody has a shelby but you can use the car from last week with the same tune on it the porsche the 906 Now, the car that we win is a brand new car. That's this one, the 488 Pista Ferrari. So we need to look into that, if that's a good car in S2 or not. But that's a brand new car, so that's the one you win from the trial. Uh, the trial is not hard to do. Um, I did it with random people. There was only one car that was also tuned. And uh, basically, we won. Now, let's go to the next one. The next one is Playgrounds. I'll go quickly to Playgrounds. So we need a Super Hot Hatch A800. The car that I'm going to use for that, that will be on uh, Saturday on the live stream, is this one. That one was already tuned in the previous Playgrounds, so the 2013 Mercedes-Benz A45 AMG I'm going to use. The car that you can win is the Honda Prelude of 1994. This one. Now let's go. Okay. So let's go to the next one. Here, dancing in the street scene. So you need an S2998 Hoonigan. Now, there was a uh, pretty much a pain in the ass to get a Hoonigan tuned for street. Um, 
I tried several, I didn't like them. So I came to one car that gave me a serious headache with that engine in it. I don't know what happened to the engine sounds and also the handling of the cars, but the car has been handling weird after this update. I actually used the Hoonigan Mazda. You would be surprised. Why don't you use like a Porsche or maybe this one? Well, basically this one has the highest top speed. Now there's a 2.6 rotor engine in it. It's like a Mosquito that is on speed and drives like 300 miles an hour uh, next to your ear. But it did the trick. I could win my races, as you can see here. And I also kept it very low in the PI. So the Dravatars are also low PI Dravatars. So it would be easier. Now, the car that you win from that is the... We already had that car, we already won that car. That's the McLaren 600 LT. That's this one. Okay, let's go to the next one. The Grand Moor. We need A800 Modern Muscle. The car that I use for that... I'll put my filter on. Well, I know what car that I used. That was, uh, where is it? Ford, there you go. I used my little Ford Mustang GT for that. Now, this one is also tuned uh, uh, after this one. I don't know when we use this car. I don't know when, but both cars can actually win it. So if you want this one or this one, I've put do in the description. Now the car that we can win from that is another Honda. It is, I'll put my favorites off. The, and I'll put A-Class off, there you go. That is the Civic, where is it? The Civic 2004, there we go. So this is a car that we can win from the Grand Moor. Now let's have a look at the last race. The old timer. So we need retro supercars S1900. Now, there are actually several cars that you can use for that. I'll start with my favorites and S1. So the car that I use for that, and I will always go back to a McLaren because I really like McLarens in this game, is there you go, is the F1 McLaren. I really like that car. I've been driving that car for so many months now and it, it always does the trick, that car. Now, the other car that you can use that was that I tuned, I don't know, a week or two ago for also something is this one, the Nissan R390. It actually drives very well, very grippy, very good in cornering. So you can also use that car or if you like, for example, a Lotus, the Esprit V8 is also a fun car to drive with. Now, what you can you win from that? That's the KTM. There you go, the Xbo GT4. 
Okay, let's have a look at the... Uh, I'll quickly tell you this. The rivals, if you do not like to do it, or you don't want to much, spend much time in it, just change your rival to somebody that has like a very uh, high time, and then you can easily win it. Here, if you've never been ranked before, you need to do 10 lobbies. If you've been ranked before, you just need to do one lobby. Let's go to the PR stuns. I'll quickly change. I don't know if for the PC players, but for some reason, I never changed anything about my settings, but my game is laggy since the update. I don't know if you guys have that, but I have it. So what do we need to do here? That is P-trap. Well, what do you need to do? You need to start from here. And I'll take my muzzler, of course. The street version. You just need to be careful with uh, the traffic, that's all. Well, let's see if I get traffic. Uh, okay. I'm probably going to get traffic and fail. That's what always happens. But that's about it. I think you can probably start uh, earlier than uh, where I started. Then here you have the jump. You just start from here. Now I'm in my uh, street tuned muzzle. So you're probably going to laugh and say, ah! This week he failed again on his PR stunt like usual every week. I'll try not to. And then you just flip the car a little bit. Well, you don't even need to. There you go. And the next one, uh, where was that? Here. You can just start, well, it doesn't really matter. I start from the right side. You just need to be careful with, I think, the second corner it was. Yeah, but the muzzle has the acceleration is fast enough, so it doesn't really matter. There you go. That are all the PR stunts. Now I'll quickly show you the car, the new Ferrari. If people don't have it yet, there you go. So this is the new Ferrari, brand new car that we come in from the trial. I see that it's actually steering, so that's already a good point. So it's probably, I don't know what parts and all stuff you got, but if it's already steering very well in stock, it's probably going to be a good S2 car. And I've got a feeling if it's grippy or not. Yeah, it can actually take corners, so I guess this is going to be a good S2 car to use. Yeah, it feel, the car feels good, so that's something good. Okay, I covered everything. If you have any questions or you need help, um, you can always send me a message or comment on the video below. The playgrounds, I'll do that on my live stream on Saturday. And well, let me actually know if you still want to see these videos because I'm lately not getting many views and I wonder if the game is dying or if people are not much interested anymore. So please comment that on my video so I know what to do. Okay, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video and that it helps you and I will see you hopefully on Saturday for the live stream. Bye bye.